Captain's Log, Stardate 0701-2024. <laughs> We're about to embark on a mission to the gym after a failed expression of New Year's resolutions finds us in peril as we try and work on our fitness gains for the year ahead. <sighs> Fucking dog. Fucking neighbor's dog. Seriously, done nothing but bark its ass off. Yesterday for 24 hours and now it's like, oh look, you've just woken me up again. So anyway, I guess it's my fault. Yeah, today we're going to do a workout. Um, it's, it's the first of the year for me personally because I've always failed at doing uh, the whole New Year's resolution associated with fitness. But at the same time, it's uh, you know, look, we all go through that moment, and at the same time as well, we all need to rest. We all need to take it easy. We all need to, you know, just take a step back from. How, how how busy life is and I'm going to kill a fucking dog because I'm more of a cat person anyway but join me as we venture into the gym and let me give you a tour dun, 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 dun. this is where the gains are made so yeah nice little setup don't understand why I have a gym membership if I've got all this equipment here but you know, it all comes down to, I guess, your commitment to actually using stuff because at the end of the day, if you don't, if you don't use it, you fucking lose it, as they say. All right, so this is my gym. So, as I said, there's a, uh... oh, look at that. Anyway, let's get on with it. <laughs> so, <laughs> Yeah, but gym training is quite hard, especially as you're getting older. Like I find, you know, 46 years old, still carrying a bit of weight, successfully lost 10 kilos in 2023 and been able to maintain that loss uh, at the same time. Diet is always 80, 90% of everything you do. Um, but we're all pretty completely, we're like, we're quite aware of this, aren't we? So the reality is, is that it comes down to the commitment comes down to the consistency, the routine, uh, being able to just evolve uh, in your workouts when you feel that you're reaching a plateau, change the exercise, increase the reps, decrease the tempo, uh, uh, try something completely different, give yourself, give your body a bit of a rest as well. Like all commonalities that gets preached to you on YouTube and you know what, it's quite, it's true at the same time. But uh, look, you know, who knows, there probably is something that I can give to the common person out there, but at the same time, I'm not a, I'm not a YouTube celebrity, I'm not a professional. Well, I have done a Cert 3 and Cert 4 in personal training uh, here in Melbourne, Victoria. I've just, I've really just done it as more of a, a hobby and an interest because I've been doing this or exercising with weights since the age of 17. So, you know, picked up some stuff along the way and went through through drive throughs as you can see. But, you know, yeah, we'll uh, be a roller coaster, I guess you could say. So being able to kind of integrate this now, again, back into your daily routine, that's a big struggle for a lot of people. So you're not alone in this. Um, I struggle a lot. With this stuff because yeah you, you know you get older and you need to find ways of recovering better being able to cope with daily stresses work stresses life stress family uh everything it's a it's a big it's a big thing but i remember being into a very at a very young age um obviously when you don't have so much financial stress or life stress in general and it was a massive part of my life where uh, some people have, you know, their religion and they go to church on a Sunday and it sounds silly, but it's, it's, that's what weight training and fitness is for a lot of people as well, because, you know, it, it makes you feel amazing. It, it keeps your, your, your balance, your sleep improves, uh, provided your nutrition improves as well. Your body actually responds quite effectively to it. So it's one thing to be, uh, 
completely aware of things, but it's another thing to do it, isn't it? So hence the reason why I guess we're here today. So anyway, let's uh, do some chest presses, eh? 